Hey, welcome back. No! Yeah. We're cutting in there, bitch. I'm cutting. Oh, yeah. Haha! <laughs> More likely than not. I mean, Taylor's cutting. Welcome back. Don't ever pull the veil back again. Sorry, sorry. Okay, go do your do your do this do a shot. Yeah. Take, um, take a shot. So uh, the story I was going to tell uh, last episode. Um, when I was in LA uh, working for Finn Hughes, uh, I was in a pretty nice neighborhood, and this place that I was staying at had like this like weird uh, porch thing in the back of it, right? And uh, some nights I would just sit out there and enjoy the warm weather because it was like December and it was 80 degrees outside. And I've never experienced that before. Well, I did once, but it was in the Bahamas and I was on a school trip. And that doesn't count. Um, but uh, I was just sitting out there one night. Yeah. Damn it! Every <laughs> fucking time I hate this level. I hate this level. So I was sitting out there one night and I was like, oh, there's a spider web to my left uh, near, you know, my, my legs. I was like, I wonder what kind of spider's in there. I like spiders. Oh, no. They're pretty cool. And uh, I shined a light on it and I saw the, see ya. <laughs> I saw the, the big red hourglass. No. And I'm like, all right, see you later. And then I just went inside and I called the, the lady who owned the place. I'm like, hey, yeah, there's a black widow just outside my door. And she's like, oh yeah, they come out when it gets humid. And I was like, oh really? And she's like, yeah, we're, we'll get a gardener by tomorrow to spray it with some stuff. I'm like, okay. The next day I came back, there's a brown corpse of a spider just in the same web. And I was like, man, oh, shit, that no. stuff does the trick. That is, okay, so one time, I don't know what this thing was, but it had about three zillion legs. It was huge. Oh, it like was, a millipede? It was probably, no, it was probably about this big, like huge, <laughs> thick, dark brown, and it was in my bathroom, and I didn't know what to do. because I, I The was only just, thing you can do is burn your house down. I was peeing, and I looked up, and I was like, oh, God, like it was <laughs> so big, and it's right there. And it wasn't moving, so I went and I got a golf club, and I, like, smacked <laughs> I it. I you were going to say I got a gun. <laughs> <laughs> I grabbed a golf club, and I smacked it down, and it, this thing was so, this motherfucker was so big, I could hear, um, I, like, when I hit it, I heard it fall, and I heard it bounce off my <laughs> counter, and then I heard it hit the floor. It was like, do, 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 like, Ugh. made loud thumps. And then it was still, like, laying on the ground, like, kind of squirming. So I did the only thing I reasonably could do, and while it was on the ground on its belly, I grabbed a bottle of Formula 409 cleaner. <laughs> and just and I, dumped it all over it? And I, yep, and I took a thing, uh. and I just drowned it in a pool of chemicals. Oh, God. And then I started getting a really bad headache <laughs> and feeling, yeah. like, really woozy. Because you just drowned Cause I was, something. Because I, I had the door closed, too. So oh, yeah, that'll do away. it. That'll do and it. And I was like, yeah, that was a bad idea. But I got rid of it. And I, then, I could easily get under your door. I was, you, you know, any port in a storm, Taylor, okay? Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. I was, I wasn't thinking uh, in my best mind. Nailed it. Good word, Tori. <laughs> Be a poet, Tori. Tori, note to self. Be a poet. Be a poet. Oh. Fuck. <clears throat> Me. Look, I'll be honest. I talked a lot of shit going into this game. I am not performing. No, dude, you are winning by a landslide already. I am, but I'm not performing in a way where people are going to be like, wow, this guy knows what he's doing. <laughs> this, in this guy knows video games. <clears throat> Is this John video game? <laughs> Fame wow, wait. Famed inventor of the video game. See ya. <laughs> uh, bye. Fuck, we should have made a pact to get those ones first so that the hole couldn't have been on those fucking dumbass slanties. Or I did that for my competitive advantage. No, you didn't. You don't know me. I know you enough. Great. Fair. <laughs> Fair. Fair point. Ooh, you sleep. Yeah. Have a little nappy nap. Dream the candy. Now this is where I get to fuck you. What's your favorite candy? It's my favorite candy? Yeah. Um... I like little, like the little mini M and M's. Oh, those are good. Those are amazing. I have a whole bunch of them upstairs. Oh, 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 oh! Well done. We did it. I don't know we why tied, I sounded though. like a fucking seal. <laughs> like, oh, 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 oh! Tori wins. <laughs> Tori wins. No, yeah. we tied that hole. Shut the fuck. Listen, all right. What do you want? I'm just. 
Why are you booing me? I'm right. <laughs> I'm objectively correct. <laughs> Do. See ya. And goodbye. But hey, I didn't go alone. I took him with me. Do you think... Okay, do you remember Modern Warfare 2? Yeah. Did you play that? Yeah, I played Modern Warfare 2. Do you remember No Russian? Yeah, I remember No Russian. Do you think that would fly in 2018? No. It's kind of... Uh, I don't think it should have flown then. I mean, that was... The only they reason had, they had had it in the game was to get the... Oh, what? Dude, you fucking... Yeah, dude. Nailed that. Calculated. Um, no, what? <laughs> you, it was... You absolutely do not know the layout of this hole. <laughs> the only reason that was in the game was to be edgy and get press coverage of that oh, edgy dude. shit. It was a cool mission. Well, no, it was cool because it was willing. It had the balls. You know what I mean? I guess. I respect things that have the balls. Like, uh, what's her name? Michelle Wolf or whatever. Oh, the the correspondence editor lady. Yeah. Yeah. Had balls. Yeah, she was pretty brutal. I love, okay, I, I hate getting political on this show, but I absolutely love when she did that, and then, like, all the the people who support Trump and, like, uh, a lot of the nice, but, a lot of the people in his cabinet and stuff were like, she was too mean. Yeah, and it's like, oh, who, ha who needs a safe space now? Yeah, well, like, I saw that image where people were saying, she's too mean, just s split together with another image from just a bunch of different rallies from all over the country of people wearing shirts that said like Trump 2016 fuck your feelings. Yeah. <laughs> it was just like, oh, this this couldn't be written any better. Yeah. <laughs> Where are you going after this? Who knows? You're not calculating these moves at all. How you, do I You got to stop talking about your competitive play. Yeah, who's calculating shit now, bitch? Not you. Please. Where the fuck are Wait. I don't know why I'm still going. No. <laughs> yes! Oh, no! Yes! Oh, yes! No! Oh, oh, my God. Oh! Oh! And, oh! And, <laughs> and the bad manners. Oh, boy. I calculated the shit out of that. Damn it! Yes! <laughs> oh! I am going to fuck <laughs> you! I don't. You got one shot, one opportunity. That did not sound like that song at all, Taylor. Sure it did. Sure it did. No, it didn't. However, the the thing is, uh, you got to get one star and then the hole to tie me, or to beat me, actually. I'll tie you to a fucking radiator. I'd probably like it. I'd be into that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Tori T going to Pound Town. <coughs> Not like that. Ooh, ooh. Oh, sweetie. Oh, sweetie. No. Oh. Are you shitting me? Ooh, <laughs> woo. God, if you would have made that in. Oh, that shot was fucking Fergalicious. Taylor, put a uh, Fergalicious Midi in. To the, to the, to the, hit a Fergie. You, you won, though. Yeah. You, you, won. you won. So who's Fergalicious now, bitch? Uh, I guess we'll have to find out next episode. Wait, how has it been 10 minutes? Eight minutes. I guess we'll keep going this episode. <laughs> Sorry, it felt like longer. Yeah. It, it started Which to feel longer and longer. Ooh. Ooh. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> it's just because we've been going back to back to back with these episodes. Uh, oh, I meant to use my power up. I meant to do it. I meant to do it real good. Yeah. That's what you would sound like if you uh, did it real good. Good one, Dory. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Got him. All right. That's, I got to calculate. Okay. What's going to get me more? What's going to net a better thing? I think it's so now one. you're min-maxing in Kirby's dream, dream course. What the fuck does min-maxing mean? Min-maxing means... You fuck me in the ass, dude. That backfired so yeah. hard on me. So the the way I know of min-maxing is from a YouTuber called uh, <clears throat> Northern Lion. And the way he describes min-maxing is getting the complete and utter minimum and maximum things you need to, like, 100% like a floor what do you mean the minimum and maximum so min maxing like you want the minimum amount of damage let's say and the maximum amount of reward i guess so like in the binding i've always heard it in like rpg terms what the yeah fuck? that that works like you want the least amount of damage and the most amount of items when you're min maxing instead of you know just pl 
playing the game and beating the bosses, right? Instead of doing the thing and winning the points? Yeah. Where are you going with this? This crazy. Whee! Oh, you were gonna oh, land right on that. that. Boom! <laughs> Boom! He <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> just impales on the spike. Uh. Do you remember the episode of Drake and Josh where they thought they killed the magician? I didn't watch too much of Drake and Josh. Taylor, who are you? Some weird amalgamation that was shut in for a lot of his life. You're like the kid that lives inside of a bubble. You are correct. Who didn't watch Drake and Josh? Bye, world. I'm going out in style. I knew of Drake and Josh, and I watched a couple episodes here and there. Oh, uh, comedy gold. It was pretty good from what I saw. It's so good. I love it. I don't know if it aged well. I haven't seen it in some I mean, time. The, the memes are everywhere. Oh, I know. Come on, get me up there. No. Oh, oh my <laughs> God. I thought you were about to just straight <laughs> pop it right in there. Pop, been it, pop it right in the hole. Right in Papa's hole. Tori, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know how I'm winning. Papa John. <laughs> Papa John's is the best pizza. Let's just say it. Papa John's? Yeah. Which one is that? that that's a take and bake one. I know that no, for sure. No, Papa Murphy's is take and bake. I thought Papa John's was also taken big. No! Who doesn't know what Papa John- Taylor! Taylor! You- The things you know and the things you <laughs> don't know confuse me so much. Because you could tell me everything about a million games that you've never even played or seen in real life for yourself. You just watched a streamer do it. But you don't know what Papa John's pizza is. Tori, I live a sad life. I'm so confused by your knowledge bases. But you won. You're you're turning this around. But who knows, Taylor? Maybe I'll turn it around. Yeah. Next episode. Stop taking my outros. Thanks for watching.